In this video, we're going to compare dustless blasting with soda blasting for the removal of graffiti. We did this demonstration for an organization that wanted to see if their graffiti removal fleet could improve efficiency by using our machines. They used their mobile soda blasting rig, and we used our DB225 with recycled bottle glass. The soda blaster removed most of the paint, but left a shadow of the darker colors behind. There's also a visible dust plume, despite using a wet head adapter. The speed and thoroughness of the paint removal left something to be desired. Our machine removed the graffiti quickly and easily, with barely a hint of dust. Additionally, the operator had never used or even seen the dustless blaster before that day, but he managed to set up, start, and operate the machine easily. The dustless blaster removed the paint quickly and thoroughly, leaving no trace behind. Even the black paint came off completely with little resistance. When juxtaposed, you can easily see the difference. Although bicarbonate of soda is non-toxic, it does kill plants and grass. The recycled glass used in the dustless plastic process is non-toxic, environmentally neutral, and does not harm plants or animals. Soda blasting was once the apex of blasting technology, and it still is ideal for certain types of jobs. But for graffiti removal and many other tasks, dustless blasting is faster, easier, cheaper, and more eco-friendly than any other option.